Hey everyone, today is September 28th. It's approximately 9.30 in the evening and today's topic is going to be bottled water. And the reason being is when I attended the San Diego Heart Walk a couple weeks ago, there were many vendors there um, supplying us thankfully with bottled water. And also here, it seems in the state of California, a lot of people just rely mostly on bottled water versus tap water, at least the ones that I've encountered. So there's several different websites um, that give you the source of your bottled water. So for example, um, Aquafina has is owned by Pepsi and Dasani is owned by Coca-Cola and um, Dasani actually indicates where they're receiving their water from and it also indicates that um, the other manufacturers of water, bottled water uh, tell you the types of process that they use in order to go ahead and um, give you something that actually tastes good and isn't grainy. There's even Nestle Pure Life in here in which it indicates the water source is in Erin, Ontario. So I guess the point I'm trying to go ahead and make is it's always good to know the source of where you're getting your bottled water from because if you're immunocompromised and you're drinking from a gallon or a jug that hasn't been properly sterilized, that could uh, wreak havoc on your system. And I say this because when I was in college, I worked with a gentleman who used to work for a uh, one of the large bottling companies and he confided in me stating that they never even cleaned those bottles and they would take them and just go ahead and continue to dump water in them. So do you want to go ahead and treat your body the same way in which people aren't being very careful as far as how they're treating the product that goes into your body? I'll post again tomorrow.